I'm Jenny, and today we are going to do a short tapping sequence for EFT, or Emotional Freedom Technique. And as explained in my previous video, showing you the basics of EFT, you're going to be tapping through a sequence of points where meridians and meridian endings are. And these are part of the energy system of the body. So what we're going to do today is we're going to go through a short sequence and we're going to use the topic of stress. Now, nearly all of us get stressed out. Many of us get stressed at work, have really difficult work days, and most of us have some form of stress or another. So what we're going to focus on is going to be after having a stressful work day. So it would be best for you to do this in the evening after work, but you can certainly do it any other time of day. Now, if work isn't stressing you out, but something else is, definitely still follow along because we have something called borrowing benefits with EFT. And that means that even if you're tapping on something that isn't directly relevant to you, it can still be really helpful. You can still gain some benefits on some of your own issues that are slightly relevant. So if you're having stress in other areas, follow along with us and you have two choices. You can either say the same phrases that we are saying, or you can substitute your own words. And we really encourage that a lot with EFT to substitute your own words because sometimes that makes it more real for you. So feel free to do it either way. You might be more comfortable follow along the first time you listen to this with the same words that I'm using. So what we are going to do is I'm going to be tapping on the different points. And as I do that, I will be saying a phrase. While I'm doing that, I'd like you to be tapping along with me. And then after I say the phrase, repeat it after me. So we're gonna start off with the karate chop point, right here, and repeat after me. Even though I am so stressed out, I had such a difficult day, I can't take it. They give me too much work to do. They expect so much from me. And one thing after another went wrong. I deeply and completely love and accept myself anyway. Even though I am so stressed out and it was such a stressful day and things were just so horrible at work and I can't take it anymore. I was on the verge of walking off the job. It was so bad. I just can't take it anymore. I can't handle the stress but I deeply and completely love and accept myself anyway. Even though I am so stressed, I am stressed beyond belief and I cannot take this anymore. There's a part of me that would really like to let some of this stress go because it's just too much for me. But I deeply and completely love and accept myself anyway. And now we're going to move to the inner eyebrow point and that's just where the eye comes into the bridge of the nose. All of this stress outside of the eye. I can't take all this stress at work. And now under the eye. It is just way too much for one person to handle. And now we're going to do the nose and chin together. All of these ordeals I have to go through at work, why do they put me through so much? And then down to the collarbone, you can do it this way too. I can't take all of this stress. It is killing me. Under the arm, and remember that's where your bra strap comes around if you're a woman. If you're a man, roughly about four inches under your armpit. All of this stress is just too much for me and I really need to let some of it go. And now the liver point, which is just beneath the breast. All of this stress, I can't take it. And now the wrists, so we're gonna do those together or you can just tap with your fingers this way, but it's great if you can do them together. I'd really love to release some of this stress. I would feel so much better if I could just let the stress go and have a peaceful and relaxing evening. And then the top of the head. I choose to let some of the stress go and I choose to have a peaceful
peaceful and relaxing evening. Now take a deep breath, let it out slowly, and see how you feel. Now I didn't ask you to rate how you felt before we started, which normally we would do in a full session, but you might want to think back to how stressed you felt. We like to rate it on a scale of 0 to 10, 0 meaning that you wouldn't be stressed at all, and 10 being stressed like to the max overload as much as possible. So if you can think back to how you felt before we began and try to figure out what a number might be, where you would be on that scale, and think about where you are on that scale right now. And chances are that number has dropped for you. Now, if we were doing a full EFT session, we would be getting much more in depth with specific things that stressed you out, specific things that happened, and specific emotions that you felt. But since we're not doing a full session, we're just covering the basics here. Also, too, with a full session, we would be continuing and doing several rounds because in one round, it's not going to be a miracle cure. Every once in a while, something will completely clear down to a zero after one round, but those are rare, so please don't expect that of yourself. But usually after several rounds, we can get it down. So hopefully that is helping you and you're feeling a little less stressed right now, maybe even a lot less stressed, and that would be so wonderful. If you still feel like you're holding on to a lot of stress, Feel free to repeat that sequence over again and you can use the exact same words or change them up to fit your end situation and see how that makes you feel. If you're interested in having a full EFT session, I'd love to work with you. And again, my name is Jenny. My website is charlestonreikihealing.com and that is charleston, C-H-A-R-L-E-S-T-O-N, Reiki, R-E-I-K-I, healing, H-E-A-L-I-N-G dot com. So I look forward to hearing from you. If you have any questions, feel free to drop me an email and check out the rest of the information on the website. If you haven't already seen my other video going over the tapping points, please do check that one out. And I look forward to working with you. Thank you so much. Namaste.